My lord, our people are starving and afraid. The White Hills have driven them away from the ironwood groves. Out of the way! To make matters worse, your brother Ethan had me collect provisions from the small folk. And so they come to us, looking for food. Food we don't have to spare. How can we support an army and retain our position in the north? We can't even feed the people we see before us. It's like the dead of winter's come. These are hard times, to be sure. Harder than I've ever seen. But I'll do whatever it takes to get us through it. Well, I hope we can figure something out. As long as the White Hills are in our house, we have to be careful. Come on, you! Let me go! You can't do this! Good. Uh, You're here. Uh, look. Look at this! Uh, did you see what this girl did? She attacked my man like an animal! Bloody bit me! Yeah, now it's her turn! Uh, She's gonna get what she has coming to her. This won't go unpunished. Fine. You brought her to me. I'll deal with her. That's not for you to decide. I saw him stealing from our kitchen, and I told him to stop. He laid his hands on me, so I bit him. Bloody wench! I was only doing what had to be done. I warned you not to mistreat my men. Someone will have to answer for this. Do you hear me? Thieves have to be punished, so your man got what he deserved. He's lucky he didn't get any worse than that. So you've given over your duties to this girl, then? Or can you not control your sister? Don't listen to him, Roderick. And if you can't rein her in... Yeah, what, what about the rest of them? It's about time she saw a real lord again. You can shout and preen all you like, but it's just for show. You do as your father lord wishes. And even he knows that punishing girls was never part of the deal with Ramsay Snow. And how would you know? Eh? It was poor little Ethan who dealt with the Boltons. Oh, this house is rotten. And the problem starts at the top, Roderick. Careful, boy. You yourself had the gall to make threats against my men. And that's the real problem with you foresters. You're too fucking proud. Always have been. It was bad enough when you were above us. And now it's even worse. Because you don't see how far you've fallen. Still high enough to look down at you. Wait. Forgive her. Forgive her. The passions of youth. No one questions your authority, Griff. You have the power. Oh, I like him. You thought this was your man, Roderick? He's mine. A dog to be sure, but my dog. That's how I like to see you, Foresters. He's a loyal member of my house. A man of peace. And he deserves to be treated as such. You don't get it, do you? You Foresters need to learn when you're beaten. <laughs> you will learn some fucking humility. Or oh, this won't be the last lesson I teach you, Foresters! Have you no honour? I'll run you through for that. I'll cut you down like straw men. Take him, Roiland! My bloody pleasure. I'll fucking kill you myself! No. Make him watch this. I bet this makes you angry, eh? You probably want to get up and hit me. But we know how that would go, don't we? Now, are you going to be a good little forester? Learn your lesson and stay down. Roderick! I will not yield. You bloody snot. Why don't you fucking get it? <laughs> get up, Roderick. Stay down, my lord. Your brother Ethan didn't know his place either. Ramsay Snow taught him good. Talia here will meet the same end. 
Unless you're a good little forester, you learn your place and stay down. Some forester is gonna learn their lesson today. Don't you dare! You stay down! Stay in the mud like a dog! This is my place! You fool! My lord! What?! Bloody cripple! Are you fucking deaf?! You! You'll never keep the foresters down! Hold there! Or you're next! <coughs> Please, Lord Griff, not the arm! <coughs> if you persist, Lord Roderick may lose it! <coughs> now, stay down! Tell me! Will you be a good little forester? Oh, oh you, you can't. I command you! Let him alone! I'll... You! You should fear me! I'm in charge here! You know what they did to me at the Twins? Shred my face! Put their swords through me! Tried to smash my skull open! But they couldn't kill me. And you're not the man to finish the job. Don't think this is over, Roderick! You'll see! I will make you suffer for this! Trust in that! My boy. Careful, he's badly injured. Roderick, you didn't let him do it. He couldn't keep you down. You were brave, but there will be consequences, my son. We both know that. <laughs>